Hey, how is it going everyone? I'm back with another video and on this video I'm going to show you the differences between uh, vanilla wine, wine staging and wine galionine. On the previous video I was showing you Consortium, a game that I installed. Actually I tried it with the... I, I was recording a video but the game had some problem uh, uh, when running with Gallium 9. So as I say before uh, Gallium 9 gives a super great uh, FPS boost or performances boosts, boost, but uh, sometimes it doesn't work and uh, uh, the, 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 the point of, of this video is going to show you the differences out of the box so I don't want to fix the game or try to fix the game to get it to run. So I'll take a game that I know that runs, that is Far Cry 2 that I've already installed, that I'm playing right now. And uh, I'm first going to show you one prefix Far Cry 2 because I'm actually uh, playing with uh, a Gallium 9. All right, so right now Gallium 9 is disabled as it is the the biggest or the main uh, wine staging patch which is CSMT all right both of them are disabled so right now you can consider it as wine uh, as vanilla wine actually has some patches that are are, run, are are there but the the biggest patches are disabled all right and i'm going to launch it i'm going to launch it with the gallium hud which I use a lot and which I'm going to do a video later, maybe, if you guys like it. Boom. Okay, so right now let's launch the game using vanilla wine. Let's continue my story mode. I will say that the most important uh, graph here is a GPU load so the third one you can see starting from left CPU usage per core I have Axeon octa core or actually four core plus hyper threading oh actually the game has apparently some problems using vanilla wine as you can see I never actually I just installed and launched it with Galleon 9 this is a Kopak test texture, I guess. No, Kapok. All right. And as you can see, the, the performances are not so great. GPU load is like 30%. So right now my, my graphic card is working like at 30%. As you can see, the frame drops. Those frame drops are because of the translation between DirectX I mean, from DirectX to OpenGL, it takes time to to translate. Th thus, the, the the frame drops. CPU usage it's like uh, waving. As you can see, I'll I'll say that we are around 30 FPS, sometimes 20 with some huge FPS drop. Actually, not so huge, but FPS drops are there. And GPU load around 30. All right, I'm going to quit and I'm going to set, I'm going to enable CSMT, so the biggest uh, wine staging improvement patch available. I'm going to run it. Basically what this patch does, it improves the multi-trading uh, OpenGL how OpenGL translates. Actually, it's not working. What the fuck? I'll try again. Yes, now it's working. And I'll go story mode. Continue. So we will probably see a higher CPU usage that we can see already. You can see that almost all cores are 
are, are at least at 10 percent we probably we see a higher GPU load let's go outside still we have the problem the texture GPU load still 30 so the and you can see that the C, if you if you go back and see the CPU usage, you can definitely see that the CPU usage it's way higher right now with one staging. And the FPS, yeah, actually I'm on 60. They are higher, or at least the max FPS is higher, but still it's it's not enough. I can't even record at 60 FPS or at 30. I mean, you can see that the, the, the drops are real. I'm going in this bus. Not now, but later with Kalion 9. You can see actually there are huge problems. Even with... with even with the with, uh, wine staging. My girlfriend is calling me, but I have no time. So, I'll enable right now Gallium 9. So, as you can see, you can't have both. So, it's either one or the other. All right. So, I'm going to launch the game. Here we are. Story mode. Continue. And right now you will see a huge differences on FPS, on CPU usage, and on GPU load. Look at FPS right now. I mean, 100. And the great thing about Galio 9 and is the FPS drop. The most important thing is that the FPS never drop to 5, to 10, to 0, to 1, to 3, to... It stays... Uh, it's constant. Let's say if it's 60, it's constant to 60. It never drops. Even if I look around, okay. That's the, the greatness of Gallium 9. And this happens because there is no translation between DirectX and OpenGL. When uh, DirectX is um, implemented in the Gallium framework. All right. And as you can see, the texture here are correctly displayed. CPU usage is, it never reaches 100, even if I am... Oh, let's go inside. Even if I am recording, which is great, I'll just pick up some diamonds. Alright, just shooting some bandits right there. As you can see, the FPS are super stable. And I would say that this game doesn't run great. It has some problems. Like it crashes sometimes. As you can see also on vanilla wine and wine staging, there was the texture problem. But it's running. It's running great with Gallium 9 with no no issues at all. Super realistic game by the way. But anyway, this is what you can expect from uh from Gallium 9, all right. So this game, for example, runs great. It never drops to 15 FPS or to zero FPS constantly as soon as you move up or down, 
all right but some games doesn't work for example i was trying consortium and consortium wasn't launching at all all right at all with galleon 9 zero i'm gonna destroy that car yeah that's it if you're using amd definitely install a uh, Gallium 9 patched wine. Gallium 9, by the way, it's already included in Mesa. It have it has been merged in Mesa already. So those are the differences that you can expect when running a game. If the game runs with Gallium with Gallium 9, it's gonna improve a lot. Maybe it's not gonna reach twice the the maximum FPS, but the minimum FPS is going to be super higher than normal all right this is the great thing i don't i don't care about playing at 200 300 400 fps i like to play when it's 30 fps that it doesn't dip to 20 to 50 to zero it stays 30 it stays stable the best thing that gallium nice uh, gives you is the stable fps the minimum fps is way higher but then sometimes you know you can have problems like consortium not running all right that was it i guess for the first video maybe i'll try to install some steam games and or maybe i will talk about wine tricks yeah I'll, i don't know you will see all right hope it was helpful and see you in the next video bye bye